Hi, NWHL fans, and welcome to this month's Player Corner. I'm Madison Packer, Ribs player, involuntary vegan, and proud high sock wearer. Let's welcome our contestants that will try and bring some glory to their respective teams, some with more work to do than others. From current standings last to first, we have the new Buttes, Allison Mateo, currently in last with 35 points. Fellow Wolfpack and Riveters member, Keely Hutchison. Kenny did us no good, Hutch. We're sitting with 40 points. Uh, mm -hmm. Lindsay Eastwood from the new Toronto Six. Tori Sullivan from the Boston Pride, who let us know last minute that she's too good to join the game show. Uh, the Wales, Amanda Conway. You all have 42 points. And finally, atop the leaderboard, Amanda Boulier from Minnesota with 43 points. Thanks for joining, guys. How are we doing? Very good. Good. Ready to win some games here. Before our first oh, uh, Hutch and Allison, you guys were roommates at Maine. Right? We were, yes. Got any good stories for the crowd? We have a lot. But let's just say that we lived in an apartment that was really nice when we first got it, and we absolutely destroyed it. And now we didn't get our security deposit back, which I'm upset about, but we had a good time, if that can say anything about that. Anything you want to add to that? You guys must be I good mean, at a lot of Pilates workouts in there. Hey. Yeah, so yeah. much so much room for activity. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, well, I'm going to share my screen for a second because, uh, Lindsay, you were roommates with Birdie in college, correct? I was. I was. Uh-oh. So we asked Birdie in a video to share. Hey. Oh, no. <laughs> this is I'm stressed. I'll have some explaining to do in a minute. Uh-oh. Hey, it's your girl, Big Birdie, coming in hot. And I'm coming for you, Lindsay. I'm about to expose you. Oh. So for those of you who don't know, Lindsay and I, former roommates, former teammates, former friends, and now she's playing for the Toronto Six. Let's just say I'll see you up there, Slooge. <laughs> anyway, back to the story. Up in Syracuse, we've been going big health kicks, you know, eating healthy, extra workouts, any little thing we could do to get a little bit better on the ice. Proof to the coaches that, you know, we were ready. We were, we were going to be the player that they wanted to put out there. So anyway, long story short, we would send pictures of our meals to our trainer. And one thing you may not know about Lindsay, she does not like vegetables. So what would she do? She would take frozen vegetables, heat them up, put them on her plate, take a picture, and send them to our coach. Our trainer, excuse me, not coach. I'm being exposed. <laughs> even that was too much effort. Trust me, I get it. I was there. I get it. She would even text her parents for their meals. <laughs> Let me tell you what, Chef Sluge. Those pictures look pretty good. And I hope Coach Parker is not watching this because we would be in the doghouse if he ever found out. So uh, defend how you want, kid, but I was there. I know. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. Exposed. Uh, you know what? To be honest, sometimes I wouldn't even heat up the vegetables. I'd just take the frozen vegetables and put them right back in the bag. <laughs> just, to, just to prove a point real quick. Oh, man. Exposed. Was she, was she exaggerating or is that true? Uh, it's pretty true, to be honest. <laughs> I've come around to vegetables now, but I think it was uh, just the forcing of the pictures. It just turns you right off, right? So you get creative. <laughs> all right. Well, that's Birdie's contribution to the conversation today. Um, all right. So we'll get started with our first game. This one was difficult for the last group. So hopefully you guys will be a little better. Uh, so same thing. I'll, sh I'll share my screen again in a second. Does everyone have a piece of paper and a pen? I need to yeah, get cool. one, one second, sorry. Leave it to the riveters to not be prepared. <laughs> oh, man. All right, so it, you're going to see four words will come up on the screen, and they're, it's all scrambled up. All of it is hockey terminology. Um, 
it's either one word or two words. Uh, the ones that are two words have a space in the middle, but the letters aren't necessarily where they would be in the word, if that makes sense. So like water bottle, the W could be in the second half of the word. What? <laughs> so you're going to try and unscramble the words. And once you unscramble, just shout your name and that'll be like the buzzer. And whoever is the first one to unscramble the words wins the round. Do you want us using our last names? Because we have two Amandas. Good point. I can just say boo. That's good. Great. That's fine. <laughs> as soon as you see them, you can go. Oof. Are we supposed to see them? Okay. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, boy. Oh, we're... Oh. Come on. This is impossible. Yeah, I'm clueless. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. <laughs> we're actually not too far now. Okay. This is hockey stuff? Yeah. It's all hockey stuff. The first one, I keep seeing the word Febreze for some reason. <laughs> Close. That just helped me. Okay. Oh, me too. Thank you. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Boo is ready. What do you got? I've got what? Freezer what? Skates Warm Ups Water Bottle. Freezer oh, Skates Warm Ups Water Bottle. Oh, Febreze. Oh, man. Yep. <laughs> I would have never gotten breezers. One point for Boo. If someone didn't say Febreze. So thank you. <laughs> Trying to help everyone out. You go out. <laughs> All right. Ready? Next round. Oh boy. It's all so wait, are the white caps still in first place? <laughs> yeah, you were in first place and you're the oh, only one. I was just I was just checking. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna deduct ten from Boston for Tori's absence. Yeah, nice. absolutely. Does that have to do with hockey again? Is all they hockey? come out of the league? Yeah, they'll all be. They'll all be. Uh, they're all hockey terms. Um, hot. You extra time. Do this one, and we're gonna kick you off the call. Oh boy. Okay. I have no idea. Oh my god. I can't even peek because I'm screen sharing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I mean, you can. Yeah, you totally can. Let us know. <laughs> Whoever sees it first. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't tease us. <laughs> oh. <yeah. laughs> okay. Oh, man, I might have spelled it wrong. No. All right, I got it. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. I got it. caps. strike again. I think I said I got it first. I don't I said I got it first. I think it was Hachi. I'm ready. She was louder anyways. I always win in that category. I always win the loudest. White caps don't need any help. We'll give it to Hutch. On or off the ice. <laughs> Sorry, boo. Ooh. Fine. Okay. Goal, jersey, soakers, puck. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Next four. Oh man. What is what is soakers? I'm French. I don't know everything in English. <laughs> Skate guards. I didn't know that one either, and I'm not French. I, I wouldn't. I, I, yeah, I'm, I'm English, and I don't know that one. Okay. Yeah. I made the words and I didn't know that one, so. <laughs> so good. All right, ready? Last four. All right, these ones are easier, I think. Jesus. Well, wow, number three. The number threes are not good to me. <laughs> Oh my 
Come on, Hutch. I got two. I don't the some are hard, man. So hard. Oh. Number three is an accessory. That doesn't make sense. No, oh, yes, it does. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Okay. Accessory. My brain doesn't work like this. No, not at all. Can you give us Me another neither. one for an accessory? It attaches to your helmet. Sometimes. Especially as a mini mite. It goes in your mouth. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think. No, 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 no. Yeah. No. Maybe. Hold on. Let me spell it out. Okay. White caps. God, Hutch. You're going to have to deep. Sorry, Stacy. <laughs> oh, wait. You got it. Oh, wait. I got it. I the think. newbies aren't making a good impression either. Locker room? Yeah. Oh. oh. Duh. Grace keeper? Grace. <laughs> 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 did I make that up? <laughs> I have it. it works, though. The clock is back on. I have it. What did you, what did you say? A lace taper. Right right I didn't know if that was like right a... Letters. A lace taper. I didn't know if that was a chirp I didn't know about. <laughs> it's a little lace taper, you know? <laughs> like ankle bender. I have it, I think. All right, I'll tap out. <laughs> what do you got, Hudge? Locker room, clear tape, mouth guard, Zamboni. Yes. Clear tape. Lace I see it now. paper. <laughs> Lace paper. That's gonna be a new one. chirp. It'll catch on. You guys just wait. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know if it was a, a chirp I was unaware of. All right, so Stacy's going to calculate the scores. It should be pretty easy since uh, it was all the same people. Um, but the newbies will have a chance in the next round to get some points. So. Yeah, yeah, definitely. For sure. Scores, Mattel, you got Warming it. up. Warming <laughs> up. I'm ready. She's camera shy. Did you guys watch Tiger King during quarantine? Sure did. Oh. Nope. Absolutely, yep. I did. Hey, all you cool cats and kittens. <laughs> <laughs> I got like halfway through and I was like, this cannot possibly be real. You didn't oh, finish God. Tiger King? No. Wow. You it gets see worse and better. Tiger yeah, King is alarming. Go now. Fun since I watched it. That's like months ago now. But with yeah, big year quarantine. Yeah. So do you think Carol Baskin did it? Yeah. Obviously, yeah. of course. Something just came out about her that there is more evidence about it. She definitely of course. Did. Rest in peace to her husband. But she yeah, she didn't get caught though, did she? Or yet? No, she because she fed him to the tigers. No evidence. There's no evidence. Oh. What's that TikTok song? <laughs> uh, Carol Baskin, you know? I don't know the rest. Mm. No, it's, it's Keep going. I I don't know if I recognize it yet. I don't remember <laughs> the word. All I know is that she killed her husband. <laughs> All right, so uh, Stacy was hard at work tallying the scores. Didn't take long. Uh, the Buttes are still in last. Uh, Hachi picked up some, some uh, ground, so now you're tied with uh, Lindsay, uh, Tori. Actually, Tori's in last because we're docking the pride 10 points for her not showing up. <laughs> so, um, Frenchie, you moved into second to last. And then Conway and Lindsay and Hutch are tied at 42 points and Boo is in the lead with 44 points. We'll give, we'll give the Buttes a half a point for, for bad instructions. Name the three Jonas Brothers. Oh, got it. Hutch, you got that way too quickly. Uh, Antarctica. Um, oh my gosh. That dog is adorable, Mattel. All right. <laughs> and Hutchie, the big moves. <laughs>